We're not going to merge it some more. Well, we are. <laughs> we can merge it with this, so. Pray, pray that God will give you something of, uh, uh, of import that you can carry with you throughout the week based upon what's in here. Or what's not in here. Okay. No. It is, it, it is a uh, little, small, microforce shaver without a battery. There's all sorts of ways to go with <laughs> this one. Actually, I'm going to combine both of those. Microforce shaver and no battery. Sometimes in our life, you guys are going to be talking about repentance a little while in Sunday school. Sometimes in our life, especially this time of the year, you've passed your New Year's resolution. So you come up with your plan to clean yourself up. You've looked in the mirror and decided, I need a micro shaver. A lot of things are pretty good, but it's a little rough around the edges. I need to clean it up a little bit. And you decide you're going to make your life better, make yourself better by your own self-efforts. And you lack the battery. Because the real power to change our lives, the real power to impact our lives, the real power that's going to make any eternal difference is not our power. It's God's power. So next time you see Eric's little micro four shaver with no battery, consider that. You probably do need some areas that need to be cleaned up in your life. There probably are some changes that need to be made. But don't rely on yourself to do it. Pray and seek God and His power and His presence to make these changes in your life.